Just got off the phone with my husband. He just called me and asked me if something happened yesterday that he wasn't told about. And I'm like, what do you mean? Because he got kind of um, in from work late last night. And um, he said, have you looked out at the bird feeders this morning? And I said, well, I've been outside, but I hadn't looked out that way, you know. Um, he said, well, you are gonna think I'm probably crazy. And I said, well, I said, it depends on what it is. <laughs> so he uh, was telling me something was going on with the bird feeders. Y'all, check this out. I usually have a red one hanging there. And that one right there is usually not bent over. Um, it's like bent, bent. And he's like, the red one's not even there. It's missing. And we were talking. And I said this, and he said, well, I thought you would think I was crazy if I said it. I said, no, I don't think so. But I do believe we had a bear visit us last night. Um, he opened the crates on the sides for the treats he didn't really damage this one which was shocking he didn't figure out that you could push up on this one but let me show you this so i'm looking for the red one because i was like what did it just take it off in the woods or something so i'm going and i see a pile here and i'm coming down the yard and it's like a trail. And I keep on going and I look over this little knoll here. And there is the red one. And if you look at the red one, puncture mark right there, there, there. I really do think it was a bear. Because ain't no raccoon or a possum or anything like that can bend a pole over like that. Ain't that wild? I've never in my life had that happen before. Um, we got these black gnats. I don't even know if y'all can see them in the video, but the flying around, they still have not let up. Um, but yeah, <laughs> I never in my wildest dreams would have thought we would wake up to something like that and so I was telling them I was like well should we continue to feed the birds because if he come in the yard for my bird seed will he get my chickens so I don't know that is kind of wild and thank God with my husband because both my husband and my middle boy Chance they get up fairly early in the morning to go to work um, Chance has been known to get up about 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. Uh, Jason about 6 or 6.30. And I'm just thankful that they weren't coming out of the door and not really paying attention and that bear be standing there. So, yeah, that's pretty wild. <laughs> and I just wanted to hop on here real quick um, to show you guys. So, this will probably be a short video. Hope y'all are having a wonderful day. Until next time, we'll see you soon.